Along with fireworks and barbecues every 4th of July, San Diegans pick the most patriotic pet. This is so cute. Yeah, and in this morning's Zebley Zone, Jeff has a throwback from 2017. That's not that long ago, is it? When he hosted the Larry Himmel Memorial Patriotic Pet Contest. It would be un-American to not love a parade of pets on the 4th of July. Welcome to the 7th Annual Larry Himmel Memorial Patriotic Pet Contest! Larry may have thought working on a holiday was for the dogs, but he loved Rancho Bernardo, as well as an easy assignment on America's birthday. We got the beard, we got the hat that he's really happy about. Larry's wife, Joan, his son, Miles, and their family dog, Cosmo, all told me... <laughs> Judging a pet contest is like barking up the wrong tree. It's all up to you. <laughs> you could tell by the look on my face. One overall prize. I'm not comfortable either no. sending any of these dogs home with tails between their legs. Felicia. So I made the audience decide using democracy. Crystal. After all, this is the melting pot of all like pet contests. A... You drove from Washington, D.C. to be here in Rancho Bernardo today. Yes, with my daughter and the Great Dane in a van. <laughs> Dressed to the nines for the fourth, How you doing? there was Gentry, a Boston Terrier, with his owner, Mike. Now, are you from Boston? I know. New Jersey. <laughs> we need to talk about your governor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's on the beach. What can I tell you? Chris Christie may be in the doghouse, but this crowd was in a fur-giving mood. As cute as they all are, I feel bad for the other people coming up to this stage. It's a dog-eat-dog -dog world. Sure, we could fight like cats and dogs over which pet is the cutest, <laughs> or we could simply follow our hearts. The 4th of July is very special to us. His uh, dad was in the Navy. His dad passed, and so we, we like to honor Thank you. Only in America can a boy named Bailey dress up as Lady Liberty and be your top dog. In the Zevely Zone, Happy Fourth of July. Jeff Zevely, CBS News 8.